Hi friends, welcome you all to Taladalal's Kitchen. I Chef Arshna today is going to show you a Diwali recipe named Mawa Karanji. So let's start making the Mawa Karanji. First thing I'm going to make the dough. For that, I'm going to take some maida, melted ghee, a pinch of salt. I'm just going to mix this first and I'm going to knead this into a firm dough. Make sure while kneading you're adding water little by little. So my dough is ready, it's nice and firm. Now I'm just going to cover this with a lid and keep aside for 10 minutes. Till then we'll start making the stuffing. Now for the filling, I've taken some mawa. I'm just going to crumble it lightly. Now to this, I'm going to add some dry fruits, raisins, almond slivers, pistachio, some sugar, cardamom powder to give a nice flavoring and few saffron stands. I'm just going to mix this well. This Mawa Karanji is one of my favorites. I do not miss out making this on Diwali. So now the filling is ready. Let's start rolling. Before that, I'm going to divide this dough into 12 equal portions. So now our dough has been divided. Let's take one portion. I'm just going to roll this 3 inch diameter circle. And here you can see I have not used any flour as this melted ghee added inside the dough. Now put the mawa stuffing in the center and then fold it into half, press it lightly and now you have to just pinch it and push the edges inside like this to get this shape. So you can see how beautifully it's creating a pleat. And yes, my karanji is ready. In the same way, I'm going to roll the remaining karanji. So all our karanjis are shaped and ready. All we need to do is deep fry them. Here I'm going to deep fry in ghee. So make sure your ghee is not very hot but medium hot. So the ghee is properly hot. So let's deep fry few at a time. So now we need to deep fry this till it's nice golden brown in color and you make sure you keep on turning it occasionally. The flame for this is very important. This karanji can be made and stored in an attached container at least for two days. So now it's nice and golden brown in color. Let's drain it. So in the same way, I'm going to deep fry the remaining karanji. So let's remove the last batch. So all our karanjis are deep fried and ready. All we need to do is just serve it. So try this recipe in your kitchen this Diwali and give us your comments. Bye-bye. Download the Tarla Dalal app on your Apple and Android devices. Follow us on the Facebook at tarladalal.com. If you enjoy our recipes, click like. To see more of my recipes, click here. Please share your comments. I would love to hear them. I'm waiting for them.